Hi, Joel Evans here from Geek.com with Brian Jepson from O'Reilly. You probably remember Brian from our sneak peek of Cupcake, and now he has Donut for us. I think uh, after playing around with Donut for a couple minutes, the first thing I noticed is it has made the G1 usable. It's yeah. actually very fast, very efficient. The browsing is fantastic. Why don't you take us through some of the new features that yeah. we're going to find in Donut? It's wicked fast, as we say in New England. Wicked fast. Um, you know, just taking a look at the browser, won't really see any new features there. But one thing that you notice is that things tend to load pretty fast. But while we're waiting for this page to load, I can start going to another site and typing, and it doesn't drag as much as uh, it used to. It used to be that if I would um, start typing while a page was loading, it would uh, just take forever and uh, typing would be all laggy and just really frustrating to deal with. So pretty much at this point, the only thing that's really slowing you down is either the speed of the site or the speed of the network. It renders very fast. Now we've got a new search box that we can use for searching the web or searching uh, content, which is really a lot of fun. And um, you know, we can look for geeks. What do we know about geeks here? I don't have a lot of geeks on my... Um, Oops. And there you go. So it's going through the entire phone, searching for everything related yep, to geek. Yeah, people. Okay. Humans. Um, and so the market is pretty cool. It's. Um, I think when you saw this, you said, "Oh, looks like they hired a graphic designer." And they sure did. You know, there's uh, apps, games, uh, downloads, shows you stuff that you already downloaded. Um, as you can see. It's pretty geeky here. Actually, this is a must-have app. I'll tell you. Out of the box, Android doesn't do OBEX, so I can't say I take a picture, I want to send it directly to my computer mm -hmm. over Bluetooth. I can't do that. And so instead of busting out the um, USB cable, I can just use this app. So if I'm in a picture and I, and I you know, use share, it'll pop up. I can use Android OBEX and just say, you know, what computer, what device. Um, I think it was free, but I would have paid two bucks for it. Shh, don't tell the developer. Um, and, you know, so you've got apps, all applications. You get, like, nice little categories here, entertainment, uh, the top free, the top paid, the brand new, a.k.a. Justin. I don't know who Justin is, but I guess these are his apps. Video babes. Yeah, look at that. No, no. We'll look at that one later. No, no censorship, no jurying. It's the unjuried, uncensored app store. Uh, okay, what else? What else we got here? Well, my favorite thing is, is buried in settings all the way down to about phone and you hit battery use and it shows you uh, what's causing your problems. And sometimes it even offers suggestions. Let's see, display. Yeah, reduce the screen brightness. Yeah, yeah take that into consideration. Uh, voice calls it should say shut up. No, it doesn't. Okay, well, it should. Layer, application info. Oh, look at that. It knows it's a GPS app, right? So it says, and then hey, you can stop it right there. Yeah, and it also lets you turn the GPS off, or, you know, right from the, you know, so you know. So it gives you some, it doesn't just say, oh, uninstall the app. It knows a little bit about what the app uses and what it consumes. Mm -hmm. and gives you an opportunity to uh, kill it there. Um, well, we saw the browser. We, we haven't seen the, the camera yet. Do, I, do you mind if I rotate this? Not at all. There we go. So, um, you know, yeah, we don't see anything. Let, let's be risky here with our camera and, and, and maybe maybe get some glare. Yeah, so, um, you know, the user interface has changed. You can do the iPhone-style thing where you can make dogs bark by pressing a button. I mean, take picture by pressing a button, and you can easily switch to camcorder mode. And, uh, hey, human beings, cool. They're changing their mind. And uh, you go back to the last picture you took. I swear I'll learn how to tap things. And as you can see, like if I wanted to share this really beautiful picture, you know, this is kind of familiar, but I just wanted to show you. See, Andrew Obex is right there, so mm -hmm. it lets you mm -hmm. push that over to another computer.